Welcome to our channel, where each episode is a fascinating journey through the wonders of nature. Today, we are about to explore the 10 most dangerous and deadliest spiders in the world. From lethal venoms to impressive hunting tactics, each of these spiders will take us to a universe of fascination and challenge. Join us as we uncover the secrets behind these extraordinary creatures and delve into the astonishing diversity of the arachnid world. Get ready for an experience that will expand your horizons and leave you amazed by the complexity of nature. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and like this video so you don't miss any of our exciting wildlife adventures. Ready to embark on this journey through the magnificence of the world's most dangerous spiders? So let's go. The armored spider, also known as Phenutria, is one of the most feared spiders in South America, especially in the Amazon region. She is known for her aggressiveness and powerful venom. Here are some important points about this spider. The venom of the armored spider is extremely powerful and neurotoxic. It contains a mix of toxins that can cause a range of symptoms, from severe pain and swelling to neurological and cardiovascular problems. Armed spiders are known for their aggressive nature. When they feel threatened, they can attack quickly and bite repeatedly. Habitat These spiders are found in tropical and subtropical areas of South America, such as Brazil, Peru, Colombia, and Venezuela. They generally live in wooded and humid areas. Armor spiders are relatively large and robust with long, thin legs. Their color varies from brown to orange-yellow, with distinct patterns on their bodies. When a person is bitten by a spider spider, Symptoms can include severe pain at the site of the bite, excessive sweating, nausea, vomiting, increased heart rate and blood pressure, as well as possible respiratory problems. Treatment for a spider spider bite usually involves medical care to alleviate symptoms, such as analgesics for pain and antihistamines for allergic reactions. In severe cases, it may be necessary to use antivenom to neutralize the venom. The Black Widow, of the genus Latrodectus, is known for its reputation as one of the most dangerous spiders in the world due to its potent venom. Here are some important aspects about this spider. Black widows are found in many parts of the world, including North America, South America, Africa, Australia, and parts of Europe and Asia. There are several species of black widow, with the best known being Latrodectus mctans in North America. Black widows are easily recognizable by their dark coloring and rounded body usually shiny black with red markings on the abdomen. Females are larger than males and have a more potent venom. Black widow venom contains neurotoxins that affect the nervous system. Although the amount of venom injected in a single bite is relatively small, it can cause a variety of symptoms, including severe pain at the site of the bite, muscle spasms, nausea, vomiting, profuse sweating, and increased blood pressure. Black widows are generally shy and prefer to avoid contact with humans whenever possible. They generally only bite when they feel threatened, such as when they are handled or disturbed in their nests. Although black widow bites can be extremely painful and unpleasant, they are rarely fatal to healthy adults. However, young children, the elderly, and people with compromised immune systems are at higher risk for serious complications. Treatment for a black widow bite usually involves medical care to alleviate symptoms, such as analgesics for pain, muscle relaxants for spasms, and, in severe cases, antivenom to neutralize the venom. Brown spiders, of the genus Loxaceles, are known for their potentially dangerous bite and their ability to cause necrosis in the affected area. Here are some important points about these spiders. Brown spiders are found in many parts of the world including South America, North America, Europe, Africa, and Asia. They are most common in dry, dark areas, such as basements, attics, and in frequently frequented areas. Brown spiders are generally small to medium in size with long, thin legs. They vary in color, generally being light brown to dark brown. A distinctive feature is the presence of a pattern of six eyes arranged in three pairs, unlike most spiders which have eight eyes. Brown spider venom contains a mixture of necrotizing toxins that can cause necrosis in the skin around the bite area. Symptoms may include localized pain, swelling, redness, itching, tingling, and, in severe cases, skin necrosis. Brown spiders are generally nocturnal and prefer to hide during the day. 
they generally only bite when they feel threatened or disturbed, such as when being handled or squeezed against the skin. Although brown spider bites can be painful and result in complications, deaths caused by these spiders are extremely rare. However, the severity of the reaction can vary from person to person and depends on the amount of venom injected, as well as the individual immune system response. Treatment for a brown spider bite usually involves medical care to alleviate symptoms and prevent the progression of necrosis. This may include cleaning the affected area, applying cold compresses, painkillers for pain, and in some cases, corticosteroid therapy or surgical intervention to remove the necrotic tissue. The sac spider of the genus Chiracanthium is a spider that belongs to the Clubionidae family. Here is some important information about this spider. Sac spiders are found in many parts of the world, including North America, South America, Europe, Africa, and Asia. They inhabit a variety of habitats, including outdoor areas and indoors. Sac spiders are relatively small, around 6 to 10 millimeters long. They have elongated bodies and long, slender legs. Their coloring ranges from pale yellow to light brown, and they often have a dark V, shaped marking on their back. Sac spiders are known for building small silk sacs in which they shelter during the day. They are mainly nocturnal and hunt mainly at night, feeding on small insects and other arthropods. The venom of sac spiders is considered relatively weak compared to other venomous spiders. Their bites usually cause mild symptoms such as localized pain, swelling, and redness. However, individual allergic reactions may vary. Although sac spider bites are generally harmless to humans, they can cause temporary local discomfort. In rare cases of severe allergic reactions, it may be necessary to seek medical attention. Because sac spiders can be found inside homes, it is important to maintain good home hygiene and seal any cracks or gaps around doors, windows, and other entrances to prevent their entry. The Brazilian armor spider, also known as Lonomia, is a species of caterpillar that can be dangerous to humans. Here is some important information about this creature. Lonomia is found mainly in South America, especially in Brazil. It mainly inhabits tropical and subtropical forest regions. The Lonomia is a medium to large-sized caterpillar, about 4 to 5 centimeters long when fully grown. Its color can vary, but is generally brown or green with lighter spots or stripes along the body. Although Lonomia is not a spider, it is known for its ability to inject dangerous toxins when it comes into contact with human skin. These toxins can cause a serious condition known as Lonomia syndrome, which can lead to internal bleeding, disseminated intravascular coagulation, DIC, kidney failure, and, in extreme cases, death. Contact with the Lonomia caterpillar usually occurs when people touch or accidentally crush these insects. The risks are greater in areas where these caterpillars are more common such as the tropical regions of Brazil. Symptoms of Lonomia syndrome may include severe pain at the bite site, bruising, bleeding gums, dark urine, vomiting, fever, and other symptoms associated with clotting disorders. Treatment for Lonomia syndrome usually involves intensive medical care to control symptoms and provide life support, such as blood transfusions and treatment for disseminated intravascular coagulation. The Ciro spider, also known as Latrodectus tridicum guttus, is a species of black widow found primarily in Mediterranean regions, including parts of Europe, North Africa, and Southwest Asia. Here are some important points about this spider. The Ciro spider is endemic to Mediterranean regions, where it generally inhabits rocky areas, holes in stone walls, tree trunks, and other sheltered places. Like other black widows, the Ciro spider is recognized by its small, rounded, dark-colored body, usually black or dark brown. Females, larger than males, have a distinctive violin-shaped marking on the abdomen, although it is less pronounced than in other black widow species. Ciro spider venom contains neurotoxins similar to those found in other black widows. Although the amount of venom injected in a single bite is relatively small, it can cause serious symptoms, including severe pain at the site of the bite, muscle spasms, sweating, nausea, vomiting, and in extreme cases, respiratory and heart problems. Like other black widows, the Ciro spider tends to be shy and generally prefers to avoid contact with humans. They generally only bite when they feel threatened or disturbed, such as when being handled or squeezed against the skin. 
Although bites from Ciro spiders are relatively rare, they can be dangerous to humans, especially young children, the elderly, and people with compromised immune systems. In severe cases, a Ciro spider bite may require urgent medical attention. Treatment for a Ciro spider bite usually involves medical care to alleviate symptoms, such as analgesics for pain, muscle relaxants for spasms, and in severe cases, antivenom to neutralize the venom. The web spider, also known as Atrax robustus, is one of the most venomous spiders in the world and is native to Australia. Here are some important points about this spider. The web spider is found mainly in the southern region of Australia, especially in humid habitats such as forests and coastal areas. Web spider venom is extremely potent and contains neurotoxins that attack the nervous system. A single bite can release a significant amount of venom, causing severe symptoms in humans. Web spider bites can be fatal to humans if not treated properly. Symptoms can include intense pain at the site of the bite, sweating, nausea, vomiting, difficulty breathing, muscle paralysis, and even cardiac arrest. These spiders are usually found in webs built in holes in the ground, tree trunks, or other dark, damp areas. They are active mainly at night and feed mainly on insects and small vertebrates. Although web spiders generally avoid contact with humans, they may bite if they feel threatened or disturbed. People who live or work in areas where these spiders are common are at an increased risk of bites. Treatment for a web spider bite usually involves emergency medical care, including administration of specific antivenom to neutralize the venom. It is crucial to seek medical assistance immediately after a bite, as early treatment can be vital to recovery. The hobo spider, also known as Tegenaria agrestis, is a common spider in North America, especially in the Pacific region, and is known for its shy behavior and nocturnal habits. Here is some important information about this spider. The hobo spider is found primarily in North America, especially in the Pacific region, including the western states of the United States and parts of Canada. The hobo spider has an elongated body and long, thin legs. Their coloring ranges from light brown to dark brown, and they often have indistinct body markings. They are relatively large compared to other house spiders, with a body that can reach around 1.5 to 2 centimeters in length. Hobo spiders are often found in human environments such as homes, basements, sheds, and garages. They prefer dark, undisturbed areas where they can build their webs and take shelter. Hobo spiders are nocturnal and tend to avoid contact with humans whenever possible. They are shy and usually hide in crevices and holes during the day, emerging at night to hunt. Although there is some controversy regarding the toxicity of hobo spider bites, they are considered less dangerous to humans compared to other venomous spiders such as black widows. Their bites can cause localized pain, swelling, and redness without serious systemic symptoms. Although hobo spider bites can be uncomfortable and cause skin irritation, they generally do not pose a serious threat to humans. In rare cases of severe allergic reactions, it may be necessary to seek medical attention. Preventing encounters with hobo spiders can be achieved by eliminating possible hiding places and food sources around homes and buildings, as well as through appropriate pest control measures. The funnel spider, belonging to the genus Atrax, is a species of spider found mainly in Australia. Here are some important points about this spider. Funnel spiders are endemic to Australia and are mainly found in the southern and southeastern regions of the country, including areas such as New South Wales, Victoria, South Australia, and Tasmania. Funnel spiders have relatively large, robust bodies with long, slender legs. They vary in coloring, but generally have a dark brown to black hue. A distinctive feature is the funnel-shaped web they build to capture prey. Funnel spiders generally inhabit areas of dense vegetation, such as woodlands, forests, and wooded areas. They build their webs in protected places, such as crevices in rocks, tree trunks, and bushes. Funnel spiders are predominantly nocturnal and spend most of their time hidden inside their funnel-shaped burrows. They are agile predators and pounce on prey that falls into their web. Funnel spiders are considered extremely venomous and are responsible for several fatal bites in Australia. Its venom contains potent neurotoxins that can affect the nervous system, causing serious symptoms including severe pain, sweating, nausea, vomiting, difficulty breathing, 
muscle paralysis, and even cardiac arrest. Although encounters with funnel spiders are relatively rare due to their shy behavior, their bites can pose a serious threat to humans. People who live or work in areas where these spiders are common are at an increased risk of bites. Treatment for a funnel spider bite usually involves emergency medical care, including administration of specific antivenom to neutralize the venom. Rapid intervention is crucial to avoid serious or fatal complications. Crab spiders are members of the Theraphosidae family and are known for their great diversity and impressive size. Here are some important points about these spiders. Crab spiders are found throughout the world, with a great diversity of species in the tropical and subtropical regions of the Americas, Africa, Asia, and Australia. They inhabit a variety of habitats, including tropical forests, savannas, deserts, and even urban areas. Crab spiders are known for their large size and robust appearance. They have hairy bodies and thick legs, which give them a superficial resemblance to crabs, hence the name crab. Their color varies widely between species, with shades of brown, black, gray, and even blue in some species. Crab spiders are generally solitary and nocturnal. They spend most of their time hiding in underground burrows, holes in tree trunks, or among rocks. They are skilled predators and feed mainly on insects, arthropods, and small vertebrates that they capture with their poisonous prey. Although the venom of crab spiders is generally less potent compared to other venomous spiders, it is designed for subduing prey and can cause localized pain, swelling, and redness in humans. However, crab spider bites rarely pose a significant threat to humans and are generally less serious than bites from other venomous spider species. Some species of crab spiders are popular as pets in exotic insect collections. They are prized for their striking appearance, interesting behavior, and ease of care. However, it is important for crab spider owners to be aware of the specific care needs of these animals and to take precautions when dealing with them. Crab spiders play an important role in the ecosystems where they live, helping to regulate insect populations and contributing to biodiversity. They also serve as food for a variety of predators, including birds, reptiles, and mammals. Discovering the 10 deadliest and most dangerous spiders on the planet was a truly chilling journey from spiders with lethal venom to spiders that weave incredible traps. Each of these creatures has taken us on a fascinating exploration of the arachnid world. Not only were we impressed by their hunting ability, but we also became aware of the importance of understanding and respecting these natural predators. As we delve into this universe of danger and adaptation, we are reminded of the incredible diversity and complexity of life on Earth. If you enjoyed this incredible expedition through the kingdom of spiders, be sure to subscribe to our channel for more exciting content about nature, and don't forget to leave a like. Thank you for joining us on this journey full of discoveries and mysteries, and until the next adventure.